YouTube! Welcome back to the series where I ruin shows for myself for your entertainment. Today we are watching the first and last episodes of Sword Art Online. I've never seen this show, but I've always wanted to know what it's about. So today I'm going to try to see if I can put together an entire synopsis based off the first and last episodes. Let me know how I did in the comment section down below. Subscribe for more videos like this. And without further ado, let's watch the first and last episodes of Sword Art Online. All right, here we go. We hopping in. This is kind of intense music. 2022? Wait, that's literally in a couple days. The one thing that I do know is that everything is a video game. Nothing can possibly go wrong from living in a video game. If you die, you just respawn, right? You don't get paper cuts in a video game. Bye, sis. I'm gaming. Leave me alone. She's talking about nerve gear. I caught that. Is that like the VR headset? VR MMO RPG. Which you is this the headset? Link start. Link start. Yo! I'm in the grid. This is the metaverse. Welcome to Sword Art Online. Thank you. This seems nice so far. Ooh, the music is killer for one thing, but are we inside? We're in already? I thought this was going to be a lot bigger build up. There's a kid in his bedroom getting right into the virtual world. I like this person with the pink hair. <laughs> Yeah, out of breath and in the video game and just like real life, man. So he's got to be new. He wants to know how to get, get through like the basics. Klein. Kirito. Kirito and Klein. Oh my god, I just knocked him out. Oh, it's a boar? If you get it just right, activate a sword skill. Oh! Ye good night. Take him out. Give us some bacon. We need some pork chops. Yes! 07 virtual piggy. Where's the bacon, bro? Congrats, you killed a pig. We just wait till the final boss. <laughs> this is a really wholesome friendship developing, isn't it? I really like this duo so far. You say that now, but I got a feeling things are gonna turn sideways eventually. Like, I just don't like the name Nerve Gear either. So 10,000 people are in here too. Keep in mind, that's an important thing. Get the floor eight in the beta <laughs> jump. I bet his real life is so hard. Like the game is what he immerses into to feel more alive. He's hungry. <laughs> he got Uber Eats pizza, man. This is how online relationships really are though. They're the most wholesome of all. Oh. Friends to the end. Nothing could go wrong. This anime is so fun. What do you mean there's no button to log out button? It's usually right there below the op- No, they usually keep it between options and help. It's not there anymore. It's probably a glitch. You know, beta. It's pizza! No! Why does he put mayo on the pizza? That's the real crime. Uh, kill yourself. You have to go through the menu, so there's no other way because it's nerve gear. You're immersed that deeply into the code, the program, the metaverse. This is Mark Zuckerberg's plan all along. You can't. It's. Yep, you're immobile. This is scary, bro. I knew this might be a big problem point. Getting stuck in the game. But I'm getting like freaked out with the thought of it actually really happening. What would you do? I have a mom and a sister. So he can get out because people could take him out. What are you trying to, why are you asking? Dude, he's trying, to, he's trying to get it right now. I feel as if though, this is going to have some really negative consequences for leaving the game early or before the devs say you can, or if you find a way out. Like I feel like death or some kind of bodily harm can come to you if you do things the wrong way. It's nerve gear. I mean, it can stop you from moving and make you immobile. These are the 10,000 people here. Oh no. What do you mean, warning system announcement? <laughs> oh, no. oh, we ain't getting no pizza today, bro. Oh, that's blood. What is that? Hello? Is this an event? <laughs> it's the DLC, bro. Kayaba. I feel like I got bad guy vibes from you. It's the guy, the creator of the game, right? Yeah, I'm trying to leave. Can you tell me where that's at? Am I being held hostage in a video game? No one from the outside can do it either. So it doesn't even matter. My brain! Everybody's figuring out death. I'm sure that their families are all rushing to each of these 10, 9, 10,000 10, 10, some people now. Wait, hold on. The only way to get out is by clearing a game. But it's an MMORPG. I haven't played a lot of them, but don't they kind of don't, not like, not in? Your avatar will be lost forever if you get if you lose your health? Dude, I'd be the first dude to die. I see. Okay, so we will clear if it's floor 100. 
Thanks. That was so kind of you to give us a present in our item storage. Mirror? Uh. Uh. Okay, we're fine. We're still fine. Wait. We look a little different. Yeah, dude. Ah, this is how they really look in real life. Oh! What's the point of making this many people suffer? Create world and intervene in it? What a sick deranged psycho to create something like that. Trap this many people inside and say you have to beat the strongest boss up here. This is truly a battle of the truest gamers. This is about to be bad. Oh, the paper cut! That was really well done. I thought it was so random that we had the paper cut at the beginning. Physical pain you feel on the outside will be brought into the real world too. So many questions as to why he's done this. Oh, poor little girl. She was just having fun with her brother's VR set. <laughs> I'd be the type of dude to go right for the final boss. So you gotta upgrade. You gotta level, grind materials, get food. <laughs> this is the worst video game I ever bought, man. I'm not rating this very high on Steam, if I'm being honest. He's got friends to save. Is he gonna die at some point in this series and everybody's gonna cry? Oh, I hope he's still alive when we get to the last episode. I hope we see him again soon. I mean, I won't know because I'm only watching the first and last episode. Yeah, we're gonna make it to the top. Slay that doggy! Watch him lose half his health. Nice! Oh, that's, that's clean. Okay, that's some clean animation. Dang! There's some emotion in that screen. So this is a really fascinating concept. They're trapped here until they beat level 100. Not really sure if there can only be one winner or if there could be multiple. I think anybody who can complete it can, can go back to real life. I really like these two characters they introduced us to as well. I hope they both stay alive long term. But it's gonna be fascinating to see how not only this character, but everybody else's families respond to the being in the game, the worldwide response to this kind of problem. I think this main character here has a really tough life at home home and games is kind of what he escapes in and so having gone this far to where he literally can't unescape from it it's got to be so so scary for him my prediction is that Klein doesn't make it to the end and our main character here has a lot of like some regret that he didn't stay with him at the beginning we're gonna move on to episode number 23 of season three new world again i always say this after i finish these long series thank you guys for being here with me it's been a long time coming let's wrap it up there seems to be a lot of a lot of things going on in this <laughs> this artwork down here all right, here we go. Have we made it out? Who is Alice? Wait, he made it out. Wait, he made it out. Look, that's the gear. He's out. This isn't just the... the th Wait, right? Who's Alice? <laughs> so it seems like he's been out of the sword art world for a while. Did he beat level 100 boss? I guess he must have. Hey, yo, who are you? Who's at my door? I don't want any girls got cookies. Amazon. <laughs> What's in the package? What is in here? Is that a inflatable bull toy? What is that? It's a girl! What the frick? Why are you in that box, ma'am? Are you naked? Kinda cute though. Why is she naked in the box? Oh wait, this is Alice. This is Al of course. I, I love Alice. She was my third favorite character from the show. She came here to speak to him face to face. Did she escaped from somewhere? <laughs> I guess I missed a lot in between them getting in and getting out. World's End Altar, that feels like the level 100 boss area. And she is also, she has a wire on her back. He was successful at least. Regardless, you're both here. What is there to be upset about? <gasps> her cord came off. Alice Synthesis 30. My prediction is that she's not a real girl. She's a program that made it out into the real world somehow. I think at some point or another, Rito came into contact with Alice and fell in love with her and he wanted her to come to the real world and she made it out somehow. I think that her having a plug in her back signifies to me that her body is probably robot, probably not actually human material. She's synthesized. And she's like really excited to see around a house too. And also another thing is that she had to get permission from a doctor to stay here as if it's not like her mom giving her permission, but it's like her creator giving her permission to stay over somewhere else. See, she's never seen anything like this. That goes with my theory even more. She's totally a love interest that became real. She's so cute, bro. Is she gonna fight me right now? <laughs> Are we gonna spar? So blown away. So the underworld, is, I guess, is what they're referring to as the in-game world. Yeah, we're gonna get a 1v1! I don't know how good you've gotten, but I saw you kill that wolf that one time. 
You did pretty swell with that. In that body. See, I'm so right. My brain is so giga. I love the stances. Is this their typical fighting stances before they get into serious things in the underworld? What if he breaks Alice? What if he breaks the robot? Yo. Yo, this is actually great camera work. Uh, the wood's broken. <laughs> kind of awkward we landed like this, huh? <laughs> I win. Still have my- She is a robot! I'm so smart. As long as I can wield my sword, I won't be my sword. Their battles aren't done yet? Wait, is the show not finished? Wait, family's all alive? I bet the dad hates his robot girlfriend. This music is so ominous. There's probably some very tight tension. I said I said maybe a bad home life heat they had. And they were so worried about her, their son trapped in there. They like regretted being so mean to him his whole life. Look, man, I was under a little bit of stress too, homie. Fuck. Dad. <laughs> That's obviously not her real dad, but... Are you talking about your fake virtual dad? I guess Kirito was his in-game name. It wasn't his real life name. That's why I was so confused when he was calling him that. Ugh. That's right. He fought for everybody, including me. Oh, dad. Black Swordsman? Thanks, mom and dad. What's going on here? Imagine he goes back to the game world right now. Alice? Alice, what you doing? What do you want? I'm sleeping. I'm finally back in the real world. Let me sleep for a day or two. <laughs> he freaks out. Long communication. Oh no. Came over you through the network? From who? Okay. Are we printing it? You sent that to the printer with just her brain, by the way. Can you see that? What is this? This earpiece. Yui? What? <laughs> Daddy! She's a little fairy that he created, maybe? Floors in the central cathedral. 60, okay, so these are the different of the 100 floors. An IP address. Connects to that world? The path to the underworld. Where we escape from? Go or return home? Oh, wait, she's excited to go home. I see what's going on now. She was accepting having to be in this world. Because she didn't think there was any chance of going home. Asuna? Who is Asuna? Why did her eyebrow just like quiver when she said that? She's twi twitching her eyebrow. She doesn't like Asuna. This competition between Asuna and, and Alice for my man's here. I, this is Asuna. She also real? Not real? They're going back in. I bet they've gone in multiple times. I have a pretty good synopsis of that involves them getting in and out multiple times for different missions that could somehow have an effect on reality. And we're right here. We're right back with all of our gear. Yo, these are the in-game fits. We're in outer space! Star World, you're five what? She's crying. It's like it's, maybe their world's being destroyed. Are those Easter eggs? Oh, oh. Oh no. This looks a little advanced from the first level. Oh my gosh. They're up against this giant worm. Mythic space beast? Let's go, this looks like a tail, like the tin tails of Naruto. What is this animation? It's so cool. Yo, he's so strong. He's got his, he got all the skill trees maxed out. Every upgraded weapon, all the materials needed to synthesize good gear. Oh my gosh. Nice, it's like freezing it. I thought this was just gonna be cool. This seems insane. I need to watch the entirety of this to understand. That one's got black flames. Yo! This has got to be some of the best animation I've seen for these first and last episode series. I'm trying to escape. Let's go, queen! I just met you 20 minutes ago, but I love you! Okay, so that's like their special moves. Release recollection. Okay, okay! You didn't have to go that hard! Oh, what a, what a homecoming. <laughs> Oh, let's go, man. It's probably been so long since they've had her here. I just came in in the middle of this, but I feel like I, I know everybody. Oh, it's probably somebody that died that is reminded, reminds her of... He looks so wholesome. You got chills. I don't even know you guys. 
Yeah! All the music's too good. I think that's it. I feel like I have no satisfying resolution to any of our problems we were presented in episode one. <laughs> so it seems like that is the wrap up to everything that we have officially. There's two more movies that go alongside that. This is what I think, just watching this, what would be a good theory to make? Either the places that we are visiting right now are part of a virtual space that each of these characters like Asuna and Alice are from. And along the way, we formed bonds with them and they helped us at the very end. They were separated from the world in some way and were brought back to the human world and they were given bodies to occupy for the time being here and they needed to find some way to get back home they needed to get into the space again so that they could safely be a part of where they're actually from i feel like a lot of the program here was so realistic and so well developed that it actually developed into a life of its own and had a whole world of its own and all these characters have their own backstories obviously so inherently the backstories and everything written about these characters to be fit into the game are inherently true they happened for those characters their worlds exist in the narrative of what this guy created once we beat the game we didn't want their worlds to go away so somehow we had to keep their worlds alive and active also keeping peace and balance of the real world and it seems like to me it wouldn't be too far off to say that our main character did everything he set out to do he beat level 100 able to go free and set everybody else free that was trapped but he also went back in probably a couple of times for issues concerning these characters like alice and Asuna either save their worlds, restore their worlds, or in this case, bring Alice back to her world. I don't know if Alice is real or not. My supposition is that she initially wasn't, but because of the game being as real as it is, she and everything she ever knew became real over time. So when she had her metal body, is what they said, she has a metal body brought to the real world, she still had the same feelings and she was still remembering her world. Killing off her program and killing off her existence would be essentially like killing her and killing everybody she's ever known. So for that reason, I think that she and everybody else like Asuna, I'm assuming he was also similar to Alice, were wiped out initially after he won everything and got to the level 100. And then he comes out and realizes, I just killed real people to me. So I gotta go back in, find a way to restore it, maybe with the doctor too. The doctor helps set it back up and like set their worlds up again and contain them. The only thing I'm kind of lost on is why we got separated and how did we find a way back in all of a sudden? And number two, what happened to Klein from the beginning? Did he, uh, you know, did he make it? I feel like sword art is not finished here and I can see there's a couple more movies left ahead and maybe there's more to come with manga and anime adaptations in the future. But if this is as deep as a universe as I'm supposing it is, that means there's far many more problems and threats that can in, uh, impact other worlds and other programs in my world as a human that our main character is going to have to deal with down the road. I don't know. Maybe I did all right with that and that's decent theory. Maybe I'm totally off. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Let me know what you think about my analysis. Tell me how I did. I'm sure you already are. <laughs> and let me know if this is a series that I should watch in its full entirety and get some answers to these, uh, these loose ends here. Let me know what other anime i should watch the first and last episodes too hopefully you guys enjoyed everything today as much as i did if you did and you don't mind doing so make sure you go ahead and drop a sub like and a subscribe a like and a comment and i'll see you in the next video